Well, hey guys, Brody Swisher with bowhunting.com here, and I'm headed up to the food plot here behind the house, and I want to take just a minute to introduce you to and welcome you to a brand new series here at bowhunting.com. It's the Chasing Velvet blog series, and this is just simply a blog series we're going to have going on the next month uh, as we roll through August, and uh, just kicking off uh, what we're real excited about, a hunt coming up the end of August, August 24th, 25th, and 26th. It's a velvet buck hunt, and for the first time in the history of Tennessee's wildlife agency, uh, they've put a hunt in place specifically for targeting of a velvet buck giving those bow hunters a one month early jump uh, just for the chance of killing a buck in velvet so it's a really awesome opportunity that we have our guys up north of us in Kentucky their season always opens the first part of September so they oftentimes have that opportunity to kill a buck in velvet and uh, down here in Tennessee though we just simply wait and uh, we don't kick off until the end of September the third weekend of September so uh, this is a cool cool chance for us in Tennessee to be able to have that opportunity to kill a buck in velvet just to give you a quick look at uh, one of my favorite spots. This is the spot where me and my kids hunt a bunch. It's the Ducker Bleed Line. It's right back here behind my house. And this is just an old topper that I pulled off a boat. We bought a boat for bow fishing. We pulled this topper off. I don't know if it was a welding boat or a muscle diver's boat. Uh, either way, it had this big topper. It's like eight or nine feet long, six foot wide. And so it's just a, a great setup. We pulled that off the boat, rigged the boat up for bow fishing. I said, that's gonna be a heck of a ground blind for deer hunting. We call it the Ducker Bleed Plot. And it's just a, a cool blind. We've killed a lot of stuff out of that turkeys and deer. You can see just a nice little narrow strip here. It's kind of the gauntlet. And uh, we've killed turkeys, deer, predators right here. A lot of great memories right back there in the Ducker Bleed Line with my boys. I've got some guys and gals across the state of Tennessee that are going to be chiming in and up, giving us updates on what's happening in their neck of the woods, uh, sending us trail cam photos and videos, just keeping us posted on what's happening. So I want to encourage you to check back often right here at bowhunting.com for all the updates, photos, videos, updates on what we're seeing, maybe what we're not seeing as we lead up to this August 24th, 25th, 26th velvet buck hunt right here in Tennessee. It's going to be a great time. I hope you stick with us right here for the Chasing Velvet series.